Zambia has signed its first bilateral agreement with Norway at the ongoing Climate Change Summit COP29 in Azerbaijan. The 15-year agreement, based on Article 6 of the Paris Agreement, will see the two countries engage in carbon trading. Minister of Green Economy and Environment, Mike Mposha, signed on behalf of Zambia, while Norway's Minister of Climate and Environment, Ture Sandvik, signed on behalf of his country. This concept paper, Honorable Minister, proposes the establishment of a financing instrument that supports private sector investment in the power sector through a carbon-based feed in premium payment. Today, our two countries are taking a major leap forward, paving the way for green investments in Zambia and a contribution to global mitigation ambitions. Let me also congratulate you uh, on Zambia's election as a member to the Global Green Institute's, Institute's Council for 25-26. And speaking after the signing ceremony, Mr. Mposha called for more players on the carbon market space. Our people must begin to get ready in the various jurisdictions of our country to ensure that uh, we uh, uh, produce uh, the, 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 the desired targets in terms of carbon to sell. Uh, to the market because initially the argument was where is the market. Meanwhile, Green Economy and Environment Permanent Secretary said Zambia is ready to implement the agreement. We are happy as Zambia that we are the first ones to sign, we are the first ones to work with Norway through a legal agreement that we're going to implement these projects together. So for Zambia, this means that we have a sovereign nation that has positioned itself as ready to buy any um, carbon credits that are generated in Zambia that have been approved by the Zambian government. Once effected, Norway will also finance renewable energy projects in Zambia, thereby growing Zambia's economy. Mary Wekesa, ZNBC News, Baku, Azerbaijan.